Hi guys, I'm doing a super quick run through or flip through of Explode the Code 4.5. Um, it goes hand in hand with Explode the Code 4. So basically the lesson that you can play in Explode the Code 4, there's a corresponding lesson in 4.5 um, to consolidate learning and practice the skill that you've just learned. So um, on my YouTube channel, I have gone through a lesson in Explode, Explode the Code 4 with my daughter that you can have a look at. But this is a really quick run through because I have a million of these books and a million of flip throughs to get through. So basically that's what's covered. It's the same as Explode the Code 4. Same structure as all the other Explode the Codes. Just want you guys to see the, I guess, um, how hard or easy it is so you know where to place your kids if you're not starting from book one. So again, minimal writing, great for kids with dyslexia or dysgraphia, hesitant readers, struggling um, writers and readers. Okay, let's look at ones from the back. Where should we start? Oh, lesson nine, here we go. It's good to see, like at the back of the book, where kids are ending up. Mind the kids walking through the door. All the same activities, reading, writing, differentiation, bit of comprehension. Okay, that's another lesson. These are the kind of words that you're looking at, four and a half. Hope this helps you guys. Better place your kids. I'm getting to the end of the book. Right, thanks guys. Um, jump onto my YouTube channel to see the other um, flip throughs. Oh, I've got lots of other curriculum flip throughs, so have a look. Thanks guys, happy homeschooling.